Hello everyone, I'm Palka 8 and welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Fantasia. Last time we found out that the Sylph has been eating a little bit too many beans and now they got gas. And because of that they kinda opened the gateway to hell. Or it was an earthquake or something, I don't really remember. <laughs> anyway, let's see if we can help them with their little problem, shall we? Whirlwind. Whirlwind? They're very dangerous whirlwinds. Get caught in one of those and you'll end up with more than just a scratch. What would cause something like that to appear? No doubt it's also results of madness of the spirit of wind. Yeah, that, those gases, man. Those gases. Anyway, if you go through them, you will get damaged. Simple as that. Whee! And if you get a little close to the sylph, they will just blow you away. See, sneak past that thing. Chest with apple gummy. Yeah, I, I'm full of those, so I don't need them. Okay, if I were here though, I would just tell the sylph to let the gas go. You will feel so much better anyway. Anyway, go in here. It's where you want to go. Uh, but unfortunately, you have to get blown away once again. Remember the rope that we got. Well, use it here and you can climb down. Let's see. Uh, should be new enemies down here though. Let's see. Yes, giant leeches. Very annoying enemies. Oh, and this is Autumn Sandstorm. I never showed that one. <laughs> Sorry about that. Anyway, the giant leeches can poison you with their normal attack. And they can give shit for experience. So worth fighting? Not at all. Anyway, we should probably use a holy bottle. Let's see if I can find it. There you are. This wall can be taken down with a pickaxe. No problem. Let's see. Go over here. Should be an item. Yes it is. Another wall first, of course. And we got a mix gummy. Sweet. Another wall. Yeah. Stupid walls. Come on. New enemy. Yay! Living dead. These. Well, there's really nothing really special. They can also poison you. But what they also can do is they can go underground and appear wherever they want. So they can go underground and start wailing on mint or cloth. So I guess they're interesting when it comes to that. But except for that, they're really nothing special. Anyway, open this chest for spectacles. Great. Come on, make it. Thank you. And you see, now we are behind the sylph. Let's go down here first, though. We can. F we if you talk to them, you will fight them. And here we got a kite shield. Yeah, oh, come on. Ugh, stupid battles. And an amber cloak. That's why I didn't buy those for Kles and Clarth before. That and come on. Thank you. And a kite shield. Pretty nice. I must say I love the combination of the Valoon sword and the fighter mark. It is awesome. Anyway, talk to the Sylph and yeah. It, it hurts and we have to fight him. I will do it off screen though. We already seen seen this battle. Save us. No problem whatsoever. Okay, when you go up here, you will see that the gas is very strong here. Damn, Sylph. Okay, I'm gonna stop with the farting jokes. For now. <laughs> anyway, go here and you will actually start taking damage for every step you take. Very, very annoying. This game really likes those, these places. Oh, we should be able to move that boulder. I bet we can use it to fill in that hole. Yes! And that's how we're gonna make help the sylph with their gas problem. Fill up the holes. Yeah. That's that's nice. Let's see. Ah oh, come on! Stupid giant leeches. Anyway, do it like that and the miasma goes bye bye. But as you can see we are badly, badly injured. Just use means first aid and 
we're up and we're up and kicking once again. <laughs> okay, and now we sneak past this. Be careful not be taken by the wind. And use the rope and go down here. For more hell! Yay! This area area has truly become a miniature version of the demonic realms. Really? How do you know? You already been there? Or ah, whatever. With miasma this thick, even some of the more powerful demons of the demonic realm might appear here. If we meet one of them, we have to run away. Yeah, he's not kidding. If you meet up with one, run, or you will die. You don't have a chance. There's no way we can hope to defeat him. Nope! Ah! Ah! What the hell was that? What, what are we going to do? All of this is being caused by the miasma. Those demons can remain in this world without it. Okay, so... Welcome to hell, I guess. Anyway, this save point. Use it. Even I'm gonna use it. And I got save states. Use it. <laughs> okay. Something that I want to point out though. This place. You want to have classes HP at least over 500 at all times. If you meet up with an enemy called the Hellmaster, run. Run, run, or you will be well done. Okay? You don't stand a chance. But there's something else with the Hellmaster too. I'll show you when I meet up with one. Probably gonna be new enemies down here too, so... I don't care how you keep your HP up. With uh, means healing or apple gu gummies. Just get it up there. Okay. Heal, 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 heal. <laughs> okay, take this boulder and take it down here. Oh crap. Go, go, go. Oh, please, no. Oh, okay, lizard man. Those are not that bad. They are very fast though, so they can easily sneak past your frontline fighters. They will just ra run r straight past you and start wailing on the characters in the back. They are a little bit annoying, but really not that bad. And thankfully we haven't met up with any Hellmasters yet. We've been lucky. Yeah, guess what? Now I said, now I said it. What the next battle is gonna be? <laughs> I'm so dead. Okay. More healing. So yeah, keep Cluster's HP over 500 and you should be fine, fine for a while at least. Come on. Thank you. Oh, that's not all? Oh my... There's more. There's another hole. Not cool, not cool, not cool! Ah! <laughs> it's the Hellmaster! Okay, as you can see, he his skin is actually a little bit darker. I don't know if Namco is racist or anything. And if I'm racist even thinking about it, but there's no other type of enemies or characters at all in this game that got darker skin tone. So I don't know what they think. That every black person is person is evil or something. But anyway, we class got a lot uh yeah. Heal class and ru start running. He might survive now. But if even though you run, Hellmaster could do this. Summon demon, which is why you want to be oh, at least over 500, have over 500 HP. Please run, please run. Thank you. Oh, okay, that was scary. You don't stand a chance against those. Let's see, where's my life bottles? Where's my life bottles? There you are. And just continue on with the first aid. Okay, that was good. Oh, 
good thing we survived. Holy crap, I hate those Hellmasters. Talisman! Okay, let's give that to Mint right now. <laughs> okay, I didn't really do much, but... Oh, well. Break down this wall, and there should be a boulder. Yes. Come on. No, no, no! Oh, thankfully, just some living dead. So, thank you, thank you. The game is getting... Going easy on me, I think. And by that, the miasma is gone. There's no more miasma here. Thank you. And the sylph should be back to normal. Let's just get out of here. Wow, I only met up with one Hellmaster. Lucky me. <laughs> I hate those guys! Alright, for now, I think we managed to prevent any more miasma from seeping into this world. Now let's go and meet the sylph. Bart said that the sylph could be found across the bridge in, in the other innermost er er part of the valley, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay, but let's go back for first to get this... this... Ah! Chest here with a charm bottle. Yay, pretty nice. Oh, uh, come on. Have we seen the harpies before? I don't think we have. Well, you get to see them now. And have we seen the peep peeps? I don't really know. <laughs> oh well, an extra little battle then, I guess. And for some reason, Clark is just running around. Weird. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, I can't believe I survived that place. Go. Okay, we're almost done in Lone Valley. Let's go over here. I, I just love the view here though. Even though it's a kind of badly pixelated picture, I love how it looks. <laughs> I would really like to see this place in real life. Anyway, yeah, you would think that it w would maybe be a cave or something, but nope. The sylph is just living in this tree. Nothing more. <laughs> you are... The ones who saved us by eliminating the miasma, yes? As was decreed upon this ring in ancient times, I would like to form a pact with those who command the winds. My. <laughs> oh my. The markings of your body, your soothing heartbeat, and the power emanating from the ring. You have prepared yourself completely for the task summoning. Then. We shall grant you our power. However, before that, we have one request to make. Spirits have request for a man? A human? Yes, actually. Even if you, if you form a pact with us, unless something is done soon, it will have been meaningless. I'm not sure I understand you. Why did you say that? Do you say that? Even as we speak, Mana, the source of our power, is disappearing from this world. If nothing is done, both the spirits and magic will vanish from this world. Well, that's not good. What? Why is this happening? Please, go at once to the forest of spirits and stand before the world tree, Yggdrasil. Or Yggdrasil, or whatever you call it. If you take this, you should be able to meet up with the spirit of the world tree. Spirit of the world tree? Hmm. If you hear, hear what she has to say, it might still be possible to prevent this calamity before it occurs. She? No, it can't be. I mean, that was in the future. Nah. I. Nah, it's nothing, I guess. Hmm. I understand. We will go and see for ourselves. But first, I have one question I want to ask you. Do you know anything about a young girl entering this valley alone and losing her way? If you know anything, please tell us. In the last several months, you, you three has, have been the only visitor to this valley. We have seen no other humans here as, aside from you. I see. Now then, let us form our pact. Upon the opal ring. Spirits of the wind, I desire a pact, and ask you now, submit to me. 
Upon this ring we form our pact, spirit and master. My name is Clarth of Lester, mother beepers! And by that, Clarth can now summon the Sylph. He is now actually very useful in battle. Finally. And we get the Elemental Orb, which will let us get an audience with the Spirit of the World, world Tree. And Clarth also get the title of Tamer. Ah, oh, he won't be a pain in the ass anymore. Ah, oh, too bad. Yeah, that's... That's all. <laughs> he can now summon the Sylph whenever he wants, and it only takes 8 TP. Summon the Spirit of Wind, one, one of the four great spirits. Awesome! But you have to wait until next time to see the summon though. I'm sorry, but you just have to be that way. Anyway, Palkia fan await. I thank you all for watching, and I see you all later.